Today we are very excited because we are launching in Limerick the first European Lighthouse Smart City project called City Exchange. With this project we are aiming to develop solutions for the creation of positive energy cities. A positive energy city is in fact a city that generates more energy than it actually consumes. We are going to start at a block level with five buildings and then try to replicate this across additional blocks. The Georgian neighbourhood, which is where the pilot programme is focused, was built 250 years ago on an intelligent grid system. So we aim to repurpose that uh, logic of the Georgian neighbourhood into a new type of energy system, a, a community energy grid where collectively people can share and exchange energy between buildings and between buildings and vehicles. What attracts us to the Positive City Exchange project is that decarbonisation in an urban and a city sector is going to be a real challenge if we're going to meet our climate change goals. So for us we're going to learn the impact of deploying those technologies and what do we need to be doing to facilitate that. Today is indicative of what Limerick has been doing for the last number of years. It has been leading out on innovation, it has been disrupting the market. So this is bringing how do you energise and make maximum efficiencies in old buildings. And if we crack it here in Limerick for Europe, and for the globe, uh, I think we're really on a winner and this is where Limerick is leading up. This sits nicely with our re redevelopment plans for Limerick Post Office that we would incorporate the energy efficient measures. This will kind of be a benchmark building for us. We will take the learnings we get from this project and transfer it across other offices. So what we need to do now is build relationships and match make people. So for instance, if you're doing up uh, a Georgian building and you want to install solar panels, it's much easier to do that on a terrace together so that you only have one set of scaffolding. But what about our boilers? Can we share boilers? Can we share places to store bikes or bins? Can we share gardens? People want to make their contribution so that we can say to today's children that we stood up and did our bit. Limerick will see the transformation from the traditional energy model with very large power generators to the new model with many thousands of micro generators of clean energy. And that will lead towards a city that has low or no carbon emissions, a sustainable city, a sustainable community.